Hello there and welcome to this class where I'm going to be sharing with you the eight steps to fast track your success online as a life coach and attract high paying clients into your business each and every week. We're going to talk about overcoming some of the common obstacles that I see out there time and time again and I'm going to take you on a bit of a journey sharing with you what you need instead to get the momentum that you need in your business. So let's be honest for a minute. Do you ever find that you're falling into offering a lot of free coaching sessions, but they're kind of leading nowhere? That your social media posts aren't really getting any love or you can't create any traction or know what to say or how to show up on social media. And as for Facebook ads, you don't even know where to start. Well, after over 10 years experience in the online marketing and coaching space, I've seen life coaches delay getting paying clients because they fall victim to one or both of these two big problems. The first one is doing too much. You try and embrace every marketing tactic you've seen in the hope that one will work. And this leads you to doing way too much and it distracts you from what will get you paying clients. Distractions like posting in other people's groups, thinking about what to offer and workshopping it in your head or with other coaches time and time again and getting nowhere, or creating a beautiful website that nobody really sees, trying to find quotes and captions for your Insta, or problem two, the dreaded resistance. You feel a huge sense of fear around putting yourself out there online and sharing your value, or you don't quite feel ready enough so you're lacking the confidence in your ability to get results likely because you haven't had enough runs on the board or are still working for experience who here is feeling that okay you might be stuck coaching for free or undercharging so you can avoid the dreaded pricing or what to charge conversation now you might book calls or coffee catch-ups but those contacts aren't really qualified and you're not sure how to explain what you do or to get them, how to get them inspired to say yes. So they never turn into paying clients. And in fact, it's just one big waste of time. You feel like you're never going to get anywhere. Well, you're not alone and it's not your fault, okay? It often feels like you need a whole other certification or training to get your head around what it takes to get great clients, especially online. So welcome, I'm Victoria Gibson and you're in the right place if you're looking to launch and grow your life coaching business online the right way because what, I sh what I'm sharing with you today will help you attract more life coaching clients online at a higher point, price point with a lot less work. Does it sound like good news? I hope so. Um, I can see a fair few of you coming on the call as well. So welcome, just making sure you can hear me you can see me, you should be able to have both. I'm just making uh, sure sometimes I've gone into a whole webinar and no one can hear me, no one can see me. It looks like we're all on track. Thanks for letting me know, Amber. Thanks for letting me know, Tara. Okay, beautiful. Specifically, today I'm going to show you a fast and effective way to sell life coaching for $2,000 or more per client each and every week, 24-7, you know, clients are all around the world. The beauty of online, right? Anywhere in the world, even if nobody knows who you are or you don't have a huge following yet. How does that sound? Hopefully exciting and one of the reasons you're here to start fast tracking your way through this, okay? Also in this session, you're gonna be able to overcome the most common obstacles most new life coaches face. The shortcut to building six figure a year offers online without being well known, having a ton of social media followers, networking or pitching everyone you meet. Ooh, who wants to pitch? No one, no one wants to be in that salesy energy. We are life coaches because we want to help people, right? They specifically wanna show how this repeatable system can work for you. Why everything you've been told about creating life coaching clients and how to get clients online may be the reason you're delaying your success and can easily be costing you around $10,000 a month. And the exact steps to take, there's eight of them to cash in on your coaching and stop delaying your success. I've also got a free gift for you. Stick around by showing up today to learn my eight steps to fast track your success online. You'll also get instant access to my workbook that summarizes everything I'm gonna go through today. You're welcome to take notes as you go, but um, stick around and you'll be able to download and print that at the end of this presentation as a special thank you for staying with me. 
I'm showing up. I'm committed to sharing what you can do to apply now, but apply these principles now and also move that next step forward. You'll get to ask me any questions. I'm happy to reply. You can always message me um, or reach out or ask questions as, as you listen in and I will reply personally. Today, you're gonna to discover the eight step marketing system you need right now to start attracting the perfect clients. This process is straightforward and it works whether you're just getting started or you're ready to take your coaching business to the next level. Once you embrace the eight steps I'm sharing today, you'll be able to call in all the clients you need by having a clear focus and a simple path that attracts endless clients. You'd fill it one with your niche and messaging and have the confidence to make the impact you know you're here to make now. I know that's what you want. Hi there, I'm Victoria Gibson. It is so great to have you here. I've helped hundreds of life coaches to earn more since 2011. I'm an online business coach, a certified life coach with the Life Coach School, a message to market guide, offer creation queen. I've also got a podcast. If you haven't seen, uh, seen my podcast, um, the beautiful Earn More as a Life Coach podcast, come along, make sure that you subscribe there after you've been on the training today you get a beautiful uh, value there as well. And I like, I love creating my podcast too, which is very cool. But I've helped hundreds of women like you hit revenue goals from 5K a month to 25K a month to a million a year or more. And in fact, there's some of my uh, past clients there that you can see. Um, and some of them have gone on to create million dollar businesses. I can see four of them in that image just there, which was awesome. That was taken a few years back. Um, but people get on their journey and, and just saw by being surrounded by the right strategy, by accountability, support and guidance. Um, I've been featured on Amy Porterfield's podcast, um, the Entrepreneur on Fire podcast, lot, lots of podcasts anyway, all good. Amy Porterfield in fact said um, with her wicked and smart marketing strategies, a keen eye on what's truly working now and her ability to tap into your unique marketing advantage Victoria's mentoring and coaching style is hand out, hands down the best of the best. Very kind of her to say so. She has referred many um, of her closest friends and relatives to me for coaching. Um, and I'm super grateful. Sometimes it's easy to get other people to sort of say what they think of <laughs> you being able to shout it from the rooftops all the time. But a little bit about me and my journey. I was a newly divorced mum uh, back in the day, just before I jumped out of um, corporate. Okay, so I jumped out of corporate in 2010. I went all eat, pray, love, thinking, right, I want to find my thing, what to do. I'm sick of corporate. I'm a single mother now. What, what does it all mean? Bit of an existential crisis, absolutely. I didn't quite go and, you know, move overseas for a, a, any period of time because I had two small kids to support. So I was still motivated to go, well, how can I step into my purpose? How can I fulfill those goals of helping other women have flexibility and freedom while creating flexibility? and freedom for myself and that financial freedom as well as time freedom and coming across the opportunity to utilize the power of online marketing to share my expertise just seemed to make the perfect fit but I didn't always exactly know how I was going to make it work I was doing a complete departure and went right I'm going to start a travel business and I did with boutique India travel but didn't really feel like me. I kept coming back to marketing. Marketing is my soul. Um, being able to surround myself with other women and you know that's, that's what I wanna do, support other women on their journey to creating a life of significance and transformation for themselves and others, okay? So I wanted to share that online, but I had no idea how to do it and make money. So as I went back to my heart and soul of marketing, I uncovered the opportunity to teach and share my knowledge on Facebook ads, which I basically kind of figured out myself, paid um, for some coaching to find out about back in 2011. And lo and behold, I went about anointing myself the expert and start, start coaching and start getting results so that I could start sharing it. And when I did narrow that focus, I got so much momentum, right? I became a highly paid coaching consultant, an in-demand contributor and speaker, made 150K my first 12 months online, including attracting plenty of 5K clients. So my goal in starting my own business was to make 5K a month because I was like, right, I've got to pay the mortgage, I've got to you know, pay for my kids, I'm a single mother, all of that sort of stuff. I didn't have any other sources of income coming in, so I had to make it work. So to be able to replace um, my six-figure salary within that year was just an enormous relief to me. And a lot of that was about narrowing my focus, right? I did it without posting daily on social media because quite frankly, and I hope you don't mind if I swear bits and pieces here, I was shit scared to post on social media. 
what was I going to say? What if people saw? It was all so weird. But when I could show up with my message to market with that narrow focus, it felt a lot easier to show up in a bit more of that energy than just as me, as Victoria with my mind, my brain, right? Like I, I could I could share when I had a purpose and a mission and that focus, it was so much easier to do that. I didn't have to air all my dirty laundry or bare my soul online. I didn't have to have a huge list or audience. And people didn't have to know who I was by narrowing my focus and using beautiful the power of Facebook and Facebook ads and a clear message to uh, get clients, right? So I discovered the power of simplicity. I realized I didn't need to be a big name in the industry or super tech savvy to make it all work. And especially now, you know, 11 years ahead of that, it's like so much easier with um, beautiful software and, and tech that doesn't have to overwhelm you. Um, and I could focus on creating value to one audience and it worked, which was great. And I kept that focus to multiply my results. And once I had the focus in my message to market, I discovered that I could easily call in the clients I needed on demand with Facebook ads and one simple workshop, much like this, and quickly went to work creating live and online workshops. And look, it was an absolute game changer in building demand for my coaching and calling in amazing clients. Those women I was showing you in the picture before, love each and every one of them, was able to you know, coach them online. In those instances, they come to some retreats too. But my office now completely online, pandemic proof, and create amazing transformation for my clients. So I uncovered a simple path with those eight steps. I built upon the success of one market and one message to multiply my sales and success without being a slave to social media or a wildly popular coach. In fact, most people still don't know who I am, Totally fine with that, making multi six figures online as a life and business coach, okay? Because I broke away from being a slave to social media and blogging and all the things. And I welcomed in amazing, beautiful clients that I can embrace and care about and stand side by side on their path to transformation. That's what's important to me. It's not always about, oh, great, six figures, whatever. Like, that's all great. But what really, really is important is that you are doing the work that you enjoy doing, that you do have flexibility and freedom, but you're also touching lives and impacting lives and creating a great container for transformation with people you care about, right? Your clients, you do need to love them up and care about them. You don't want to just be doing things for the money, right? I filled in the gaps, brought it all together. And when I embraced the eight steps, I didn't have to worry about where I was going to get new clients or how much I'd have to pay to get them. I could finally overcome my imposter syndrome and attract great clients rather than settling, settling for those clients that said yes, just like what I was talking about before. Because I finally felt confident in my offer because I could practice it time and time again. I landed on something that was working and I could keep going. The power of having confidence in your offer cannot be underestimated. And when you embrace these steps, you'll dramatically fast track your progress. You can get the exact coaching clients you want, when you want, at the price you want, right? You never have to cross your fingers and you never have to rely on luck, networking or word of mouth. A lot of this clarity and honing in on your message to market offer does the work for you. Like Denise Duffield Thomas has said, Victoria's business coaching leaves nothing to chance. Her proven strategies and compassionate guidance lead to the kind of up-leveling you could never do alone. Thanks, Denise. One of my past clients, Karen, she said, I just had someone pay in full for her mastermind. And two minutes later, another sale came in. 30K, 30K it's meant to be instead of $30. <laughs> oh, no, $30. Sorry, I was reading it wrong. Going $30, what? $30 under $20,000 this month as a direct result of your guidance. So she must mean $19,970. A very good month for me. Thanks, Victoria. My pleasure. Eight steps to six-figure success as a life coach. Are you ready? This is the path to simplify your success without doing any of the things that take up all your time and energy with very few results. Step one, select one target market. This is where a lot of people fall over. So the problem becomes your instinct tells you to cast a wide net, hoping to appeal to anyone and everyone, okay? But as a generalist, you become an averagist when what you need to become is a specialist, okay? Who gets paid more, a 
general practitioner as a doctor, a GP, as we call them in Australia or England, or a specialist, right? The ear, nose and throat guy who charges way more per consult than the general practitioner. That's what I want for you as a life coach, right? The way out is to select that one target market. So what segment of your market is going to benefit the most from working with you? Who can help? Who can you help the most right now? that's willing to invest, motivated and inspired to invest as well, okay? There's no point trying to sell a, a dream to people who are not you know, connected to the problem and, and can't see you as understanding that problem either. So the client may be you, just a couple of steps behind where you are now, right? So you may not have had paying clients in this area, it doesn't mean you can't help people. If you've been doing your life coach certification, you're going to have tools and um and you know modalities and ways of working with people and a lot of life coaches i know have a lot of qualifications that they can use and make their own to address a very specific target market okay so you don't have to try to work with everybody just work with the best people they're the people that you love that you care about that want to work with you too so you have that beautiful exchange no convincing no you know salesy energy it's like just beautiful value exchange so decide who's going to benefit the most and fastest from working with you and make this group your target market i know you already have them in your mind you get to just decide you may need help i can help do that this is my superpower i will give you the yes or the no or the go ahead um, to set you up for success there but when you do this you're going to make offers um make offers and charge more with much less of the resistance and overthinking and delay that you're experiencing right now Step two, solve one specific problem. Don't try and do everything for this one target market. Stone in on one specific, what I like to call a high quality problem. Is there such a thing? I don't know, but it's got to be something that they're going to be motivated enough to change. Something that um, is going to make a real difference in their life and um, that they are totally, you know, you're, bit, you're able to call them in because it, it's something that, that, that is consuming them, that it is a significant problem for them. And when you offer too many different solutions, you end up with no results, okay? So the key is solve a problem that your target market is prepared and motivated to pay for. Okay, typically it should be in the following lucrative areas of health, wealth, spirituality, empowerment. You know, you might be thinking weight loss, but a specific problem in regards to weight loss, um, relationships, all of those things, um, success, career, all of those things fall in those four categories. So keep them in those categories, but you want to niche it down. Okay, step two, solve one problem to solve out, as I said. Um, how to select your one solution. You've solved this problem for yourself. If you haven't got a lot of paying clients or testimonials yet, people are always asking you about it, something that you love sharing or you find yourself naturally turning to talk about. You've helped tons of people do it before or you're very interested in it. I don't recommend that you just become a general life coach. Well, like I said, I want you to be that specialist. General life coaching just gets, becomes so reactive and you're like this, you know, you're this container for people kind of dumping their stuff on you. You're having to work harder and it's like that duck swimming in the, the on the on the water, but underneath the legs are going like this because you're having to create new approaches and new ways of doing things for every client you get. I want you to become an expert and a trusted life coach with the one problem that you solve. One of my past clients, Julie, Victoria, I'm so overcome with emotion and gratitude today. I've surpassed twelve thousand dollars in sales officially. My calendar is packed with discovery sessions, right? Like that's what happens when you get to go, go solve the one problem for the one market. In this case, Julie was solving one problem of finding love again after divorce for divorced women with children, right? So getting really, really clear on that. She's not trying divorce men and women. It was just women, okay? So step three, create and make one offer. Okay, so step one, select one target market. Step two, solve one problem. Step three, create, make one offer. Too many times I see life coaches thinking, oh, well, I have this offer and then this offer and I'll downsell and or they already have things happening. They created online courses, whatever it might be. Or maybe you're just thinking that you have to create one low priced offer. Otherwise, people aren't going to buy from you. I'm going to show you with these eight steps that you can bypass that and go straight to high paying clients. You don't need more than one offer to do that. You don't need to suddenly go, hey, do you want this little bit to then come to the big bit? You can offer them the main course or I know in America, you call it the entree. In Australia, we call it the entree 
course before the entree. But anyway, you can offer the main course straight away. You don't need appetizers and um, entrees as paid experience, right? You can show up and give value for free and then that leads them straight to high paying clients. Okay, so it leads you straight to high paying clients. Okay, problem is you spend your time creating lots of different offers, typically at low prices because you don't have the confidence in your message to market. You're not getting the traction that you deserve because people can't choose you. They can't see you and they can't choose you. And this dilutes your impact. Okay, you'll find yourself drowning in a sea of sameness. You could spend the next six months trying to figure out different ways to package and sell your services. But when you have one offer to one target market that solves one specific problem, you'll gain experience and build your personal brand. Okay, so the solution, we're going to break through that general life coaching. A lot of coaches might tell you, just be a general life coach. If you're certified with that, you can just go and help people with those tools. And look, you can get a few clients, one and two here and there, but you'll find it's you, you run out of steam very quickly. A lot of people recommend this because they don't want to go into this discussion with you because it's not easy to advise people on what one of these is going to be commercially successful. So a lot of um, coaches do shy away from it because they don't have the experience. I am fortunate enough to have helped hundreds of coaches nail this okay and create momentum and I've also spent a decade in the back end of Facebook ads understanding what kind of offers work what kind of messages dial in where those people are and how to connect them okay so I also set myself apart in that I know online marketing at a very deep cellular level and I have a great instinct about what works and I can share that and guide you on that okay so even though clients have some unique needs, your approach should work towards delivering one common outcome. You can always, in your beautiful offer, um, whether it be one-on-one -on -one coaching or group coaching, I do recommend that you can get started with group to get scale and leverage, but if you want to stick with one-on-one, -on -one, that's fine. But you want to have one clear promise that is an outcome. It's not about the number of sessions, the length of sessions, how many worksheets you have. It's about the beautiful place you're helping take them, one promise. So start with one offer to create a solid foundation that you can expand to and then you can make changes after if you know you're feeling like it's not calling in the right kind of clients or creating the transformation that you want another common mistake is packing too much in that offer you want to be very clear and simple and focused okay so much so that we've got the mark we've got the market we've got the message and we've got the transformation which is the offer and we have the price, which you can start at sort of 2K and offer that for like a three month program, okay? If you're just getting started. If you've already had some some clients and you've had some momentum, 3K is beautiful. I have a lot of clients start at three and then move to 5K. You can keep enrolling those every week. Even if you just have one a week, it's going to start to make a big difference, okay? And when you offer that one solution and you go into specialist mode, you can command premium pricing in your niche because your potential clients will immediately see you as the best solution like my beautiful client Maria okay so she was able to just have one beautiful offer leave behind a $197 online course and worrying about what to do and how her beautiful audience of mothers wouldn't be able to pay for her women's circle training and coaching and coaching them through the, the journey of matrescence once they've had um, they've had their children and they're questioning who they are and what they want to do she uses her beautiful approach to help them step into their own unique power but also then have the ability to help others through the power of women's circle she has an um she's saying here strategies help me bring in an extra three thousand dollars a month eradicate all the doubt i had surrounding my fees and help me redefine my business model by keeping consistent with her model she now has a beautiful three and a half thousand dollar program that she enrolls she can enroll a one to two clients um, a week and more sometimes when she does a few more of her workshops and it's just a lovely six-figure offer right but when she came to me it just wasn't creating the right momentum despite having a fancy website or despite having years of experience despite having her dream in her heart to transform these women now that she has a life coaching offer that satisfies her vision to help a million mothers around the world move through matrescence it's pretty pretty amazing okay so step four show up on one platform Social media is an amazing opportunity. I know you know that, but it creates a lot of confusion, fear, and doubt. 
What do I post? Where do I show up? If I have to post here, what am I going to post? How often do I post? What kind of post do I post? Um, do I do YouTube as well as Facebook? Um, what about Snapchat? What about this TikTok? Everyone's talking about TikTok. Okay, stop, right? This burns up your time without very many results at all. Most social media and just post like your general posting strategies, they don't go very far because social media wants to make money from the advertising, okay? So you can already just jump in, work with social media and say, aha, now I have my message to market fix because you have the guidance on that or you follow these eight steps. I can start to create traction and get my post seen by everybody I need to see it. My clear one target market who's solving, who needs their specific problem solved. Not having to broadcast to everyone on social media, including you know family and friends and people I know don't get what I'm talking about, which is one of the biggest blocks that shuts you down and stops you from posting because of how you'll be seen by people who aren't ready to receive your message. We just fast track that and we say, you know what? You got your message to market. Let's get that out using Facebook and Instagram ads. Simply and cost effectively. I'm not here to say, hey, you know, show up and chuck, you know, thousands of bucks a day at this. No, we do it measured. It can start for $20 a day. So think about just the $20, um, you know, and you can do it $10 a day. You can even do it $5 a day just to see what kind of posts work. But think about how much time that's saving you with the post keeping on working time and time again. When you post um, just generally on social media and you don't have a big following, you do that post, it gets lost in the ether. Facebook or Instagram don't really take it anywhere because you don't get a lot of engagement or reaction and you don't have a big following. So you're wasting your time showing up there anyway. Yes, a bit of consistency is good. You can still have that on there and be sharing it, practicing stepping into your message, but you are going to be waiting a long time if you're hoping that Mark Zuckerberg is going to push your post without you paying for it, okay? It just does it not work okay and sure you can go on TikTok and get a little bit of momentum but you've got to go put yourself out there you've got to create a lot of videos you're going to be showing up time and time and time and time again and if you're committed to doing that all power to you and I'm just saying most life coaches are already up in their head about what do I say and how do I offer it let alone showing up with you know in crazy dancing videos all day long okay and when you outsource to a social media manager they don't have your voice they don't say things the way you want to say it and it costs a lot of money to get those people to post for you and those posts go nowhere anyway so let's sidetrack let's take what you might be investing in getting fancy photos or captions the best photos for Facebook ads are ones that you take with an iPhone. Yep, that's right. Your own iPhone, a selfie works best. Okay, so you don't need a lot of money to get started. And, and once you've got somebody and a trusted mentor to take you through, it becomes second nature. Okay, so the solution, select one channel. I say the one channel is the metaverse. It's Facebook and Insta. That is kind of essentially one platform. I'm not too worried about you posting on Facebook um, because like I said, you don't need to post a lot. We create ads that go out on Facebook and Instagram, okay? Because that's where you can reach 99% of all life coaching clients. You can amplify your messaging with very little posting with these strategies, okay? The one platform focus saves you so much time and stops all the wasted energy. It also gives you a ton more confidence because who's seeing your ads? The people who have the problem, right? And they're responding. They're saying, yes, please, I'd like to hear. I'd like to be your client. Like, it's amazing. Without you having to do your apprenticeship of posting on, on social media for a year until you figure all this stuff out, let's show up and fast track it. Like Chrissy, she was able to say, all right, well, I'm going to show up on Facebook. My clients who are menopausal women who want fitness and nutrition advice and want to go from hormonal to hot, because look at her, she's a grandma. Look at her in her tutu and her converse. I think like, she's so cool. Um, she was able to get clients directly from Facebook ads and Facebook. So what we did is we created, she wanted to create a group where she could share a private Facebook group. It was free, where she could share a training, where she could connect with her ideal community of clients, those ones who have the problem. Not everybody in the social media universe, not wasting energy on that, not fearing who would see it and criticize it. No, the calling in the type of people that care about the problem that she solves. And then making a, like showing up with great online workshops, free training, and then calling people in to be her clients. So here she's saying she hit a brick wall. She started to doubt herself. She up leveled. She was like going, ah, and then just tweaked her offer a couple of bit, and like in a, in a different way. I said, it's not your offer. It's not that there's no clients. It's the way that you're offering it. We just have to tweak it here. I have 
so much in my arsenal of helping clients over the last decade. I know how to press the levers. I like to create sustainable success so that we have this strategy that you can use time and time again. But if you go, of course, I've got a couple of little things that I can definitely pull out that um, move things around depending on your needs. She said, I now have five VIP clients. That was at $2,000 a piece, maybe one more. That was within a week, right? Pretty amazing, okay? Step five, deliver that one online workshop. I want you to be sharing and showing up with amazing free value, creating results in advance for your clients, allow you to once again more, get more confident and clear in your message. And yes, it's scary to think about creating a webinar or a workshop much like this, right? Of course it is. But when you have the clarity and certainty in your message and offer and you know that you're showing up to serve, you can stop get it, you know, stop getting in your own way and get over yourself, right? Because you're showing up in value and, sh and sharing. You're not showing up talking about, you know, your kids, um, you know, I don't know, ADHD or, or how you broke, your relationship broke down and you're struggling with this. You, you see a lot of social media people get a bit of traction with sharing every part of their life. You don't have to do that. You can come in with value and move forward, okay? Um, someone like beautiful Brooke Castillo, the Life Coach School, if you're a fellow Life Coach School uh, person like me, certified coach, you'll see she's not on there on social media sharing all the ins and outs of her life. I don't even think she has social media accounts, right? What she does do is just use Facebook and Instagram ads time and time and time and time and time again. And she fully admits that's how she built her multi-million dollar business. I fully admit that's how I built my multi-six-figure business. I would not have been able to do it without it. Absolutely not. And I've helped my clients do the same. So sharing, the problem here is sharing the work you do as a coach one-to-one -one takes up so much time. So if you're doing this whole, hey, just be a general life coach and just try and like chat to people and tell them you're a life coach. Guess what? Every time you meet someone, you have to repeat the same story. You have to connect with them. You have to understand if they have the problem. You have to identify if you can help them, if they're motivated or willing to change, invest. All of those things takes time. So if you're filling up your time, getting out there with networking events, referrals, chasing down clients here, there and everywhere with a scattergun approach, you're wasting so much time and energy and it is confirming your fears that things aren't working, right? It's the slow path. You don't need to do it. We can sidestep there because instead of, you know, speed, getting people um, up to speed with what you offer, you do this in a one to many format of a workshop. Either you have a free Facebook group where you show up with lives and it's a bit more free and easy. You don't have slides like I'm doing now, but we have, you know, some live sessions or you show up like this on a beautiful online webinar masterclass where you're taking people through structured information based on your message to market that shows up and that they get insights and ahas and value whether they decide to work with you or not best part is you don't even have to pitch them anything there's nothing to sell on this webinar i forgot to tell you uh, sorry to disappoint you nothing to sell on this webinar this is about me sharing with you how to sidestep some of the potholes or the pitfalls I see happen for life coaches time and time again. Will there be an invitation at the end to like explore further? Yes, but there's nothing for sale. You actually cannot buy anything on this webinar. And this is how I teach you the no pitch webinar framework. Go for it. It is amazing. You can sidestep all this posting and questioning and having to do one to one and get people up to speed, like I said, okay. The solution, create and deliver one value filled online workshop that builds trust and credibility. So coaching clients come to you pre-sold and ready to invest. You only need a handful of people to watch to your webinar, right? To get qualified clients. You can even automate the process, all right? If you're worried about selling, like I said, no pitch framework, ready to go. And you can even automate the process. Um, and you don't have to be tech savvy. Like I walk all my clients through this. Someone like beautiful Shalyn. Um, Look, all my clients were nervous about doing webinars or workshops. Don't get me wrong. I was too. I get it. But once you start doing, you'll see in these little posts, just the energy. People are like, oh my God, this is so great. Right? Woohoo. Just finished my first live webinar. She wasn't saying that before she did it. Still on a high, but losing my voice already. Just some stats, 201 people registered. They raised their hand and said, I want to come to that webinar. This is a new life coach helping people, right? 51 live attendees. She's a dietitian helping people with their IBS, right? Average watch time of 50 minutes. Dropped off slightly after made the offer. 18 applications for a 5K coaching program. Okay, lots of engagement, good questions, et cetera, which you want to automate it. 
Fantastic, Ainsley, um, feminine embodiment coach. Okay, just on my webinar, it was amazing. She wasn't saying that before she did it. I had 20 people live and 17 stayed right till the end and I've had three people sign up for a free consult. And then she ended up getting four people come into her five grand group coaching program. Okay, like it's so cool. Or someone like Karina, my coach code program who doubled her prices was worried about even going to a thousand dollars and then went to two thousand because i said just go to two and she's like oh i'll stay at one then went to two welcomed in two new clients in one week with her webinar that got 100 registrations pretty amazing right so then we go to step six they go to the workshop and then they book a call with you but the problem is you've been told to get out there and tell as many people you can that you're a life coach get them on and get them on a call and land new clients. This can work, but like I said, it takes a ton of time and it feels really pushy and like icky, like you got to sell your stuff and you're attached to the outcome because it's taking up your time. And if they don't buy, you feel like you've wasted an hour. But when you book calls from your online workshop, you're connecting with pre-qualified leads. You're creating demand with your workshop and shifts in knowledge before they even come and talk to you in a leverage scale way. So those people who are applying for the call after joining your value field training come with a totally different frame of reference and you come to those calls with a different frame of reference too because you get better people to talk to, quite frankly. Okay, so the solution is pre-qualified calls feel easier because you don't need to convince, cajole, push them into anything. Because no, we don't want to do, we didn't decide to become a life coach and help other people and then try and bully them into working with us, right? These people are already showing up because they're attracted to what you stand for. You're clear in your message and they get that you can help them and they want that help. They're attracted to you. They're, they, they've got the demand ready to go. You're clear on your message to market, transformation you can offer and the value you can provide. The choice is now so much easier for leads to choose you. And they're, like, they're not just leads, they're people, right? You'll be well on your way to truly becoming an in-demand life coach with this, okay? Even if you look at the math, right? We run the ads to get people to register for your workshop, okay? That might cost like, say, $5 per, per opt-in or registration, right? $500 to get 20 people live on a call, four reach out and apply, and two of those are a fit you're exploring are they a fit you're not trying to sell them but two people say yes to a two thousand dollar offer four thousand dollars in revenue from one workshop and if you haven't got an audience and you're not posting on social it's totally fine it costs you five hundred dollars to get those people to come right so you're still ahead of the game yes you pay to acquire clients right but those clients those coaches that you see out there making uh, multi six seven figures they're all investing in facebook ads i guarantee that to you if you are questioning someone that you admire or you've been following go to google um facebook ads library and put their name in the top and you'll see all the ads that they're running right so you not doing it and beating yourself up for why you haven't got success is just madness you need to get on board with this these eight steps right all the successful coaches are doing it and if they're not it's because they don't know how they haven't found someone who can take them end to end through these eight steps like i do there's beautiful robin a fertility mindset coach she said had i not coached with victoria i'd have been floundering between two business models unsure of how to move forward of what offers would get the best results for my clients the result i launched my offering straight away made three thousand dollars just from dialing in that clarity and certainty going to one offer in one market she had of course all these different markets different ideas different kind of models because nothing was working because she hadn't dialed in, made the right offer to the right market. She also was believing her own um, BS, for want of a better word, about that her market wouldn't pay, that they, you know, that she'd already offered them something and it didn't work. But we could just restructure stuff. So if you're on here today and you've already been making offers and some have worked and some haven't, then I can help you dial that in just like I did for Robin. Um, and and talking about uh, having these calls, you know, Amy just got in and said, you know what, I've got my one single market and the problem I solve, I'm just going to get on and start calling. She didn't even do webinars. So she did a lot more calls because she didn't do the webinars. I said to her, do a webinar. She's like, I don't want to, I'd rather just do the calls. Okay, fine. She still was able to get beautiful $400 a month clients with um, seven at that point. And then I think she got another five or something. That builds up a, a regular recurring monthly income that you can be, um, coaching in a group format. So not one, not filling your calendar with one-on-one -on -one sessions that gets maxed out. Instead, you have a beautiful container that you can welcome in your right clients time and time again. They get the added support of everyone on a like-minded journey, okay? So step seven, but you make the sale, right? So you've had the call, guess what? They say yes, the right people say yes. 
people will say no to. It's okay. You only need, you know, one in four, two in four to say yes, right? For this model method to work, okay? Um, most marketing that involves getting on a call with a potential coaching client feels scripted and has a pushy any energy to it. Who feels like that? Just checking in here. I see some questions down here. Yes, Amber. Oh, yes, Queen. Oh, thank you. Appreciate that. I just, I forgot to go back into your chat box. So I wanted to check in there. Good to see everyone still on here. And hopefully um, this is all making sense to you. Okay. Um, you don't want to feel pushy and scripted. I share with you um, sort of a series of secret handshakes that almost you want to get from your clients, not um, not in a way to manipulate or push, but just to guide the conversation so you're not falling into free coaching or over delivery that fills people up and gets them to go no, or um, is too pushy that people don't feel secure to move forward with you or they don't see your value, okay? Um, and it's easy to feel like slip into that convincing energy. You're not going to be attached to this because you're getting a great experience of connecting with your ideal kind of clients. Like I enjoy having the conversation. You don't have to invest in my program. If it's a fit and it makes sense, you're called to, I'll make the offer. And if you say yes or no, I'm unattached because I trust that the right thing will happen because I know how great my offer is. And I know that if people are getting on the call and they've been on a webinar, I can give them great value just on the call. And it's fun for me. This is why I want to help people. And if you don't want to help people, and you don't love your clients, you've got no business being a life coach, right? So um, the other problem that happens is a lot of people are thinking they have to follow up and they have to do it. You're not scheduling follow up calls. It's like one call, one decision. Let's go. Um, I'll give you value. If it's a no, it's totally fine. Okay. Um, and then uh, the solution is after your workshop, you meet on the connection call. People apply to come for a call with you. It's not a sales call. It's not this pitchy nightmare, right? They come pre-sold on your coaching. You can decide together if they are a fit, right? Um, you give them a reason to join and you, you outline what's going on, but you don't need to be doing that all in the workshop or webinar. So you don't really have to be salesy at all. You can show up with great value. Value first, right? Create that connection. Invite them to go to the next step. You'll see this all in action today on this call as well. But what I'm excited about mostly is calling in the kind of clients that I know I can help, showing up and sharing the value at every step of this step, whether they move forward to the next part or not. Okay, no convincing or pushing. It's a natural connection process. Okay, not a pushy process. Um, and like I said, don't do your follow up calls and a million hours of free coaching, just one call, one decision. Okay. Then we have um, someone like Luann who is being able to do calls. And um, in that instance, she was enrolling both clients into a year-long program. After she'd been doing a year-long program quite successfully and adding, um, you know, doing launches that were, one of her launches was $56,000 in that live session series in her free Facebook group. But she was still like, I still, you know, in the back of my mind wanted, want to do, um, you know, her hand analysis. So that's what she helps people do, um, use hand analysis to unlock their purpose. Um, and I was like, this is your offer. This is where you need to go. Who would think that you could go and share hand analysis on Facebook? She's getting $1 signups to her free guides and $5 signups to her workshops and $5,000 clients are costing her about $300 um, per uh, client that she gets. So that's still enough margin for you to show up, give great coaching, but you know, her list has, has doubled as well in one year and she's been able to create a six figure offer, which is amazing she is a superwoman so next step that final step get one referral by sending only one target market and solving one problem really well it's easy for people to recommend you but also it's easier to get your clients great results because you you are getting really really good at solving that specific helping the, your clients solve that specific problem and coaching them to that transformation the more experience you get, the more confidence you get, the better results you get. Your testimonials speak for themselves and bring in new clients and work for you or your clients who get great results tell a lot of people about it, okay? Once you start having that, you've got a lot more things to share on social media if you do want to post, right? Like imagine that, having great testimonials, clients lining up going, hey, you know, Mandy told me about you and I want to come and work with you. It's such a nice feeling, okay? This doesn't happen for generalists, only specialists, okay? So the more clients who come to you to solve this one specific problem, the more credibility you build, the faster 
you develop a reputation as a go-to trusted life coach, okay? Establishing yourself as the authority in the area of solving this specific problem. You get asked to be a media, like a couple of my life coaching clients. One was helping people um, live a sober life without losing the fun. I said, hey, why don't you just go and tell that, you know, massive national website, uh, write a blog post for them. She didn't, they even offered to pay her. They're like, oh, our audience really wants to hear about that because we'd honed her message to market. So she went from, um, you know, coaching people on their big goal to making that big goal about giving up drinking, right? So just message to market shifts make things so much easier and she couldn't roll a 5K client on that, right? Like huge. Um, so because of your message to market focus, because of those tweaks, and sometimes it's hard to see from inside the bottle how you tweak your message because it might sound okay to you, but you need guidance in this area. I always need to get guidance in that area too. It's really hard to make the decision on your own, okay? But when you have, it's easy to attract more referrals because you come to mind more easily and more often, okay? And um, as you build the coaching business, you get more, um, as you build that momentum, you get more testimonials and it just kind of builds and builds and builds. More case studies, you can add that to your webinar, but you can still do this with before you got that, okay? Um, so you can ask people to refer, you can offer incentives to past clients, so it's a way to even get that working. So let's have a look at the power of one. You'll notice there's one here everywhere, okay? We start with step one. That selecting the one clear target market. Two, one situationally specific problem to solve. Step three, one offer, no upsells, no downsells, no you know, entry level, no, 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 no. We just go one offer to get you to six, to having six figures in revenue from one offer in a year, okay? You choose one platform to show up on and typically that is Facebook and Instagram, the metaverse, okay? Um, and we use the power of ads to move us forward. One online workshop, whether you want to do that in your free Facebook group or you want to do an online webinar like this, we decide, I'll help you decide, okay? Yes, you're not going to be like, woo, I want to do that straight away, but you're like, yeah, you know what? I can see how that's going to move me forward and stop wasting my time on all these calls with tire kickers, okay? One next steps connected call that's actually enjoyable whether they buy or not. Like, how cool is that? They already come pre sold, ready to go. So they're ready to go to step seven and become one new client. And those results that you're getting create referrals, testimonials, and a beautiful loop. You see how this goes around and around again? Because this is what we do. This is the steps to $100,000 a year in coaching income, right? Absolutely. Absolutely. Whether you're well known now or not, whether you're a social media guru, it doesn't matter, okay? Rachel said she didn't know where she wanted to take her business. Victoria's strategies helped me double my monthly income, eradicated all the doubt I had surrounding my fees and helped me redefine my business model. Be even more confidence in my ability to consistently generate a five-figure monthly income. Or someone like Jane, who really wanted to, um, you know, coach executive women in leadership and help them, um, you know, embrace their career and make the right decisions and have a beautiful group mastermind. She always said to me, I don't think I can do that. She did a lot of workshops um, and her clients were, only corporate clients, but she was able to build up this whole new coaching practice dealing with career women who are investing for themselves. Their, their employers weren't investing for them. And um, when she said she never really believed she was going to do this mastermind, but then she was like, so far this month I've signed 90K of new work, like in a month. Pretty impressive. Now, look, you're here today for a reason. I know that. And by now, you know that this Eight steps, it's a way of attracting and converting new life coaching clients and it's significantly more effective than trying to be all things to all people as a generalist, endlessly posting on socials, getting distracted or staying in resistance, coaching for free, not making any money or any momentum. So if it's okay with you, I have an idea I'd like to share with you. Would you like to have me as your personal guide to help you attract clients you love and get them great results? Make more income with less clients and not have to worry about tech overwhelm or what things to use in or the whole online space, right? Do I have clients that get amazing results and call in beautiful clients that you love, okay? Um, and have personalized support and coaching with an experienced mentor who gets your business. Do you like that? If you said yes to any of the above, then I'd like to encourage you to apply and book a call with me. What happens during that call, okay? It is not a convincing, cajoling, pushing, hey, buy my shit kind of call, okay? This is a call where we actually get clear 
on how you can activate the eight steps that I've talked you through today. We outline the direction you could take with your niche, your offer, your pricing, outline the structure you need to embrace these eight steps that I've outlined. And if it makes sense, we can discuss what working together looks like in my Coach Co program. We'll work hand in hand as we go through that, if you wanted to decide to work with me to craft your perfect message. So you can attract the clients you can best get results for. But I'll give you feedback on your message in the call when you apply as well. Um, okay, and how to fight, get results for those who are happy to invest. Um, and you'll craft, sorry, I doubled the slides there for you. Um, you'll craft your perfect offer. Okay, we take your offer, create all the elements of your program you need to get results for your clients and fit in with your life too, right? Maybe you do group, maybe you do one-on-one, -on -one, that's okay. But what we will do is we'll make sure that you're getting a pathway to high paying clients each and every week. We're gonna move you out of a lot of that uncertainty, fear and doubt. Of course, some of that still comes up again, but time and time again, not all the time. When you've got this certainty and the confidence, you can see how with every step, it builds on your um, certainty and confidence and results that you get for yourself and your clients. Three, price for success. You're gonna stop questioning your charges and your undercharging. I'm not gonna say hey you have to do high ticket just because i said so we'll find a happy medium that you can really embrace and embody okay you give me your expertise and results you've got today for yourself or for others it's okay if you haven't had paid clients yet and i'll help you package and price your coaching for success to remove you from all that doubt fear and overwhelm it is that simple all right then Create a system that delivers a consistent flow of leads and clients. I'm not going to just say, oh, great, now you've got your message and offer. I'm going to show you the system to, that I've spoken about today of using the power of Facebook and Instagram ads to fill your beautiful client pipeline. Okay, and I'll advise you on the exact pipeline for you. It's not one cookie cutter approach for everyone, but pretty much walked you through what that looks like. So you can book that complimentary no obligation one-on-one -on -one next steps to call where we can lay out what you've got going or what, you, what you'd what you like to do. This is great if you have um, recently certified as a life coach or you're currently doing your certification of, as a life coach, but you don't have to be certified. Maybe you've already been you know, coaching clients on personal development or one area, you want help with your niche, your offer, or you just wanna get some paying clients, particularly if you've done like something like the life coach school, um, life coaching certification which is amazing I've done it myself but I saw a lot of um, coaches in there kind of wondering about what was next like they're so excited about the art of coaching they had some amazing things to share but they didn't really get help in dialing in exactly where they wanted to position themselves this is perfect for you we can explore that on the call I get you right I understand the life coach school but if you're a life coach um, from anywhere or whether you're certified or not this can work for you too okay you just have to be committed to wanting to have more clients wanting to help others transform but due to the personalized nature of these calls my space and bandwidth are extremely limited. I don't send you off to some salesperson or my team. If you message me even, I'll message you back personally, right? Because we have calls one-to-one -one personally. My calendar fills up quickly because, you know, I, I like to do other stuff as well. And um, I can only accept a handful of individuals who are ready and committed to their success. So go to victoriagibson.com, apply. You should be able to see that link on here as well. You can click it go there answer a few questions so i can, can get a sense make sure that i can help you on the call um and then you'll be able to um, schedule in a time if you can't see a time there because the calls have already filled up then there is a way that you can just message me um on that page too um and let me know what you need and i'll see what i can make happen for you so if you want to attract more likely coaching clients with more confidence and certainty if you realize you need to be making a bigger impact and you want to take your coaching forward right um and you want to have a short path to high paying clients in as little as 90 days or less right like we can make that happen quickly then let's explore your proven path to success apply for that session with me like i said next steps call we're going to like flesh this out and see how these eight steps how you can embrace them in your business go to victoriagibson.com forward slash apply or chat with me at victoriagibson.com forward slash messages the links are there you should be able to see how to do that so if you're a bit worried about jumping on a call and you're like oh, i don't want to waste your time not ready to invest in coaching then just hit me up with a message or whatever that's fine you don't you're not committing to anything other than showing up and tipping out what's happening and I'll give you 
some guidance, feedback, support and advice on the call. If it makes sense to work together after that, that's totally fine, but you're not obliged to do that whatsoever, okay? I wanna make sure that I can give you that guidance and advice because I know that it always pays me back in spades in terms of, you know, I get excited that you get back on track. I don't wanna see life coaches squandering their opportunities and staying in this stuck, you know, um, space. It's just, it's no good for anyone. Okay. So go to victoriagibson.com forward slash apply, answer those questions and connect, or just hit me up on message and tell me, you know, if you want to say, Oh, Victoria, well, I do want to work together. How does that work? That's fine too. We can look at that, but I'd rather just get a sense of where you are first. There's no obligation to move forward any further than that. And that's how Alana started out. We had a call, she booked in a call and said, you know what? I have all these offers I'm making. I've created, I've spent all this time creating all these offers and I'm making $2,000 a month. I live in New York City, hello, right? She moved forward to, we got her making $27,000 a month. And then she sent me an email saying this, um, I've made a million bucks this year alone. Victoria, you've been so instrumental in the growth of my business. You always stood by me, believed in me and showed me how to be a class act boss babe. I believed in her because I can see it. Like I said, it's so hard to see the label from inside the bottle. Get a trusted guide who can be by your side and help you. Come and join a group of like-minded life coaches on the same journey where we elevate each other to success. But you have the strategies end to end. I'm not just teaching you how to sell coaching. I'm not just teaching you how to be a great life coach. I don't teach you how to be a great life coach other than setting yourself up for success with message to market. We don't go into, okay, let's practice our coaching and stuff like that. No, we, we go into, this is how you get great clients and you become an even better life coach, okay? Someone like Julia where, you know, I, I just love it when clients come and they're so in this place of it's not working. And then she sends me, you know, a couple of months later, I think this was even in the first, you know, a few months, like I said, it's whole, whole of last year in five months, almost exclusively, thanks to you, I've earned four times as much as the whole of last year in five months. Very cool. Or someone like Janet just getting the certainty in her beautiful coaching offer where she follows these eight steps. She has ads to an automated webinar, pre-qualifying clients coming to her and these beautiful clients investing at $5,000. And she's got this group where she's helping black coaches step up, step up and create beautiful, amazing um, coaching businesses as well, um, as well as, you know, step out of, um, get moved past that fear and doubt they have as black women and feeling like they don't have the space that they need um, to step into their beautiful purpose. So, um, you know, things like uh, five sales calls booked in, two tomorrow, calling in a new client, but then she's like, Okay, another new client. I mean, she's been attracting one to two clients each and every week at a $5,000 offer. Someone like Talia, she, when she came on one of those calls and she's like, Tori, I'm not sure. I don't know if I want to invest, but I said, let's just talk about where you're at. And she's like, I just don't think it can work for me. Like I'm, she was so stuck in the one-on-one -on -one model of um, therapy and having therapy clients. She was burnt out. And during coronavirus, everyone was like needing so much and it was draining her. She had to go into clinic. I mean, I think still do telehealth and stuff. And then she's like, could I create an offer online? Yes. Within a month, she created her own webinar and got that first four and a half K client. Pretty exceptional, okay? So if you wanna have results like these, you have two choices. You take what I've shared in the training, forget about it and stay where you are. You can say, you know what, I got it. I'm gonna think on it some more. I'm gonna delay my success even more, Victoria, because I'm not sure. Or you can decide to stop waiting, stop undercharging, stop wasting time and stop settling for less. And you can embrace the eight steps to online success and to adding six figures into your coaching business in one year right? And create a very different reality. So apply for that next step session with me now. Okay. Or message me if you've got some more questions. I really look forward to talking to you. I, I look forward to helping you unlock some of those pieces to clear the way, clear the way out of your own blocks and clear out the way out of your imaginary blocks. I'm a bit of a straight shooter, as you can tell, but don't let that, <laughs> let that hold you back. I might not be the style that you want either, and that's totally fine. Hopefully you've got what, you know, a new way to see how you could get there rather than just admiring people, you know, that you see on social media and going, well, they can have it, but I can't. You can with these steps. 
everybody can. I know I believe in you. Come and join me um, on a call. And as a thank you for staying to the end, I promised this in the beginning, I want to give you your workbook, okay? Head to victoriagibson.com forward slash number eight workbook and download the workbook, which will summarize everything we've talked about here today. You can write your own notes in there as well. Um, if you have download and print, fill in the blanks and away you go. Um, I want you to have that as a special thank you for staying to the end. As I said, nothing's for sale here. I'm here to help you move forward, okay? So if you've got questions or you want to explore this, then victoriagibson.com forward slash apply, answer a few uh, quick questions there and book in for your next step session or message me. victoriagibson.com forward slash messages goes to Facebook Messenger. I reply personally um, and you can just ask, hey, what about this? Oh, I saw this, how does that work? Whatever it is, just hit me up. Um, and there's time for Q&As here now as well. I know everyone's always a little bit shy about asking questions in this format because they don't know anyone yet or they think they have a silly question. No question is silly. All the questions I answer at, at any time, if you wanted to know about your pricing, about how to enroll clients, do you do it? Um, can you enroll clients into a group program in an evergreen way? Yes, you can. Um, do I have to coach group or can I leave behind one-on-one -on -one or could I do both? I will answer those questions for you, okay? So um, feel free to type them in. I see a fair few of you still here. I want to make sure that we're there. If I missed any of your questions along the way, I will come back to you and email you my response, or you can just message me, as I said. I want to respect your time and keep this to an hour, though. So hopefully you have got um, some great insights from today. I've loved having you here. Um, always an absolute pleasure. And uh, yeah, like I said, I believe in you and can't wait to see you um, soon. Take care. Bye.